Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardozo. Nah, just once I'd love to have a storm like that around here. Vicky's giving me the eye right now. You know, I mean, it's winter time. We'd love to get some heavy snow. Well, we have the winter weather advisory that continues downstate Kentucky. Hart, Green, Taylor, Marion, Adair counties included in that. But the window for any accumulating wet snow is rapidly, rapidly closing. I do think this will be canceled in relatively short order. Nothing around the metro, nothing expected the rest of this night. There's that band of heavy rainfall. This was heavy rain. Again, south of the parkways, one to two inches this evening alone. But this band is shrinking somewhat, number one. The rates are coming down as well. But I will say this, where you see the dark Parker Greens, Greensburg, Campbellsville, close to Lebanon, and then just north of Columbia. As temperatures drop off now into the middle and upper 30s in these spots, yes, there could be a brief change over to wet snow, but do keep in mind, it's going to stay above freezing and ground temperatures are pretty warm. Plus, we're on the back side of this system. So any snow that does come down little or no accumulation expected elsewhere. It's cool, but not bad. Upper 30s and low 40s. The warm spots, we have 45 in town. Frankfurt, one better in with 46. In the city, we have cloudy skies, a little breezy out there, a little gusty, a north northwesterly breeze, almost 20. Again, that temperature 45 with the humidity running 53%. So let's go over to the future cast. Next 15, 20 minutes, you can see that band of precip. A future cast has got a great handle on this stuff. You can see it really winding down midnight to one o'clock in the morning. By 2 a.m., everybody is dry. Matter of fact, look at the clearing occurring just off to the west. That'll sweep the viewing area as the night wears on. So I think we wake up clear pretty much everywhere. And we're going to hold on to lots of sunshine for your Tuesday. A little breezy, but I'll tell you what, it looks to be a beautiful day with temperatures heading into the upper 40s to near 50 degrees. And that's going to lead us into Valentine's Day or Ash Wednesday. Here's the setup for Wednesday. A warm front's going to come through. A couple of clouds possible in the morning. Aside from that, we are looking at a lot of sunshine Wednesday afternoon. Very, very quiet conditions and temperatures even warmer heading for the mid 50s. Here's our forecast looking pretty good now. The rain, the wet snow, any wet snow that does occur to the south, that's going to be ending. Otherwise clearing later on, kind of chilly. Temperatures back around 33 also on the breezy side. Now tomorrow morning on your 12 hour forecast, Start off clear, start off kind of chilly, lower 30s. A lot of sunshine though, low 40s by midday. We're gonna go up to 49 tomorrow afternoon. And that's just about where it should be for the time of year. Look at Valentine's Day, what a great day. Lots of sun, 55, one better Thursday. Another system could bring us some impact weather on Friday. Doesn't look to be all that strong, Vicky, but it does have some colder air behind it. So a few showers Friday could turn over to flurries Friday night. Otherwise, the weekend is looking dry, just kind of chilly with low and middle 40s Saturday and also Sunday. But yeah, next three days look fabulous. Now, wouldn't you the rather have 55 and sunny than 12 inches of snow? I'm, I'm weird. I, I got to tell you, no. <laughs> 12, let's not stop there. Let's go 20, 30. <laughs> We're going to send you on vacation. You come back next week, right? Okay. Headed to the Northeast.